Some laps. Oh, okay, I'm having a contraction, but it's not like my stomach was hurting, like an upset tummy. And then I get contractions, but they're like very sporadic. They just don't feel good at all. And I lay sorry. down and it's hard to lay down. But I'm exhausted and I am tired. Oh. You doing okay, girl? What are we like? Almost 24 hours since the last time we had the camera on. <laughs> We're eating dinner with Ellen and Jared. Are we going to the hospital now? No, yes. I let's go, know. let's go, let's go. In like the third one in a half hour. I, I think know. every 10 minutes. It's been, this is Are the third one. one? Uh, well, we just ate a big plate of food, and no. so I don't know Is this number food. three? No, it's yes. like, it's more of a cramp on the side. I can't tell what's going on. Oh, it might take me a while I think to it's, figure it out. I think this is labor, girl. It's, I mean, feel it. Oh, I felt it in the bathroom. Oh. Julie. We're a half hour from home. <laughs> you guys should probably. We better hustle. Like, oh. <laughs> well, thank you for dinner. Before I have a baby, Ellie. I love you. I love we'll, you. We'll stop by the hospital tomorrow. No, I know. I hope so. I hope on your way home you can see. Drive yeah. safe, safe, safe. Okay, we will. I love you. I love you. Ooh, ah, choo, ooh, ah. No, um, curb walking. When you walk on curbs, it induces labor. This is false. I have never heard this. Go Pinterest it. Oh gosh. <laughs> This is the weirdest part about going into labor because you don't want to get your hopes up. You don't want to be, oh, no, that was false. I don't know. I literally this don't know. the same guy. <laughs> yeah, it's like, gosh, yes, this is kind of a fluke, like, little thing. Because you do contract more at night, and it's getting towards the end of the day. But is it? Oh, I don't know. Oh, do you think it's for realsies? We'll go. We'll oh. drive home, and we'll see if it's still happening, and we'll oh, keep gosh. you guys up to date. Okay, just a little quick update. We are almost home. We made it on the drive and I have not had any contractions since then. So I think it was a false alarm. <laughs> Emma just said, is Amelia late? And we go, no, she still has a week left to make her arrival, but I'm just getting anxious. A little update for you. Um, it has been three days since the last time you saw me. I'm wearing the same dress because it is the most comfortable. I don't have to worry about a waistband. I was just at the hospital. I had to do a test. So I do have an induction date set for Wednesday, and that is because um, my platelet levels keep going down, and I really wanted to go into like labor on my own, and I really want an epidural, but I kind of can't have both if my platelet levels keep going down so the doctor said I can choose to go on my own and then not have an epidural or I can choose to be induced and have an epidural so we're just gonna kind of play that by ear do I or do I not eat any more peaches and corn that is the question I am asking myself right now why am I asking myself that peaches I've been eating these for three days thank you mom but they have given me diarrhea <laughs> and <laughs> because I've had so many peaches, they are so good. And we all know that corn does not digest. <laughs> like, it just doesn't, you guys. Let's get real here. And I am literally days away from having this baby. Not weeks, like, anytime between now and Thursday, I will have this baby. And we all know what happens on the doctor's table when you are pushing to have a baby. <laughs> so I really want to eat another peach, but I think I'm going to have to like limit myself and tell myself no, because I do not want a mess for the doctor. You all know what I'm saying, right? Okay. So I had a doctor's appointment today and he did strip my membranes. I know some doctors don't do that procedure, but he did. 
And so Landon's like, oh good, stay up on your feet all day, keep moving, and maybe you'll have the baby today. Since my appointment this morning, I have had some more contractions. It's not like consistent or anything, but um, we'll just kind of see how things go, and I'm going to have to find a different lunch. It is like seven o'clock in the morning. The kids are getting up, getting ready for school, and, um, I was just timing a few contractions because I've had contractions a lot for the past several weeks. But starting about 5.36 this morning, they've come like every like maybe 13, 15 minutes. And so I just had another one. And so I'm like, Landon, I think, like I think I might get what I want, be able to go into labor on my own. I have an induction scheduled for either tonight or tomorrow morning, depending on what the hospital says. I just had like another big contraction and so we're gonna get the kids off to school and kind of see how things go this morning. It looks like Lucy and Emma are excited for a new baby. So I texted my mom this morning and I said, I'm having more frequent contractions. I may let you know if I need you earlier. And the next text message I saw was, okay, I'll hurry. Oh. And I thought that just <laughs> meant as in, oh, I'll just hurry when you let me know. But she had, you, <laughs> my mom's here. Mom's here. Well, I told her I was, you know, I'm, my bags are packed. And I I'll, didn't see that text or I would have been like, ready. oh, hold off, hold off. <laughs> I'll, I'll get ready and come and you said I'll let you know if I need you earlier and I'm like oh I don't even have time to put my makeup on I'll hurry oh no that's so funny text messages can get so like jumbled but um I'm so glad you're here this is so fun I've still had frequent contractions just not like strong and super frequent so we're just still kind of well, hanging out making just, a party out of I it I know it is a party my sisters are so cute they're like it has been so many years since we've had a single baby be born like we've had lots of cluster of cousins be born and so my sisters and I can experience this all together but this is the first time that only one baby has been born without a group of cousins <laughs> and so they're all just excited for oh, me and it is fun excited. it is just like a yeah. Ooh, no. It's fun. No. <laughs> I landed. No. <laughs> Ellie called me in the car coming here, and I says, you know, I'm I'm headed to Julie's, and oh. she's just like, Whoa! <laughs> and I'm not updating her because I'm not thinking I'm going into labor <laughs> right now. <laughs> so she's like, Where's Julie? Where's the update? <laughs> Re-enter, mom. Stage left. <laughs> hey, Julie. Do you want your present now? Or do you want to wait till after you have your baby? <laughs> Let's get it over with. Get it on. No, that's not what I said. Now, that would be fun. Well, you get it now, you might get another one later. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, you don't have to give me anything, but no, you're so cute. For you. Oh, okay. I can't wait. <laughs> she was so cute in a Marco Polo yesterday. She goes, I've been shopping. Oh, I got the cutest thing. Oh, I she's like, I you. can't spit it out. <laughs> This is a cute little box. Aww. Look how cute that is. Oh, that's so darling. Ooh, that's so pretty. Oh my goodness, that's gorgeous. <laughs> I love when I get baby Aww. gifts that are for me and not the baby. That, that is, is so beautiful. Okay, now it's probably going to need to be sized. Okay. And Oh, that's I mean, so if you want to wear it on this finger, great, or this finger. I remember when Ellie would nurse her baby, oh, and yeah. and, uh, and she, she would, would switch swap back and forth back as and to forth. what side. That is a great idea, Mom. Oh. That is oh, so it's like to keep track of which side you fit on. Like oh. I need to feed her on this side because I fed her on this side last. So it's like, oh no, I just put the ring on that side. Now I know. That's genius. That is the best gift ever. Thank That's you. very sweet. It is so pretty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you are so cute, Mom. Thank you. Looks pretty, huh? Yeah. It is so pretty. All right, hand it over. Landon's doing the phone call because they were supposed to call a half hour ago, and we'll see if I can go in tonight That's to be right inducted. Here. Yeah, to be induced, or if I get to go on in the morning. It's been contractions off and on all day, but not consistent enough to like go in. Uh, my wife Julie is scheduled for an induction this evening. Um, they're slammed, so they said keep your phones by you. We'll try to call you around or sometime after midnight. What? 
Oh, I'm glad you're here watching the kids, yeah, but that's like it. so frustrating. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> Other than I'm not going to risk not being able to get an epidural. Maybe I sound like a wimp, but this is why I'm doing it. This is why I'm being induced is so I can have an epidural. Lucy, how old are you? Lucy, what's your favorite color? <laughs> Lucy, you told me pink last time. And you told me blue. You just like lots of colors? Okay, one more question. Lucy, what's in your mama's tummy? A baby. Is it your baby sister? What's her name? Millie. Millie. What do you want her name to be? Darla. 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 <laughs> well, you can name your baby Darla someday, okay? Well, here I am 24 hours later thinking that I was going to go into labor yesterday, thinking I was going to be induced last night or in the middle of the night. I am first up on their list at the hospital this morning as a priority. So I made a little note for the kids so when they came home from school they had a little note for me. So I'm just going to put it up on the fridge. There we go. With all of the unknown, if I'm going to go into the hospital at night, in the middle of the night, in the morning, it is so nice knowing that my mom is here to like watch my kids and I can up and leave whenever I need to. Mom, thank you. You are being a lifesaver. You want me to show up too. <laughs> it's a big event. Is it finally oh, baby time? I'm like getting emotional. Oh, shooey. Yay. I was in the middle of typing up an <laughs> Instagram post. <laughs> Now it's like real time. <laughs> okay. You feel ready? Yeah. Okay. You sure? Say goodbye, Mama. Bye, Mama. Bye, my little baby. Oh, I love you so much. You be good for Grandma, okay? Okay. Okay, I love you. You're my little baby. I know it. <laughs> Hey, Cute blonde see. girls all in my house. <laughs> What's this one gonna be, blonde? You'll see the baby next time I see you, okay? Okay. Thank you for the kisses. Love you. Let's go have a baby. <laughs> I'm excited, here we go.